the descent. A violent maelstrom. Nature has a way of bringing the most devious of minds back down to earth. And shortly after the sawmill massacre, our psychopaths succumbed to the outdoors of all things. Really now, Mr. West, can we stop with the cliched storytelling? This isn't a tale from Narnia. How could you possibly know his motivations for being in that wood? Perhaps he wanted to feel closer to nature. Perhaps he was tired of killing. Just maybe he wanted to feel closer to his victims. All I know is, when the cops turned up to search the surrounding areas, they turned up nothing. And this was a place right out in the middle of nowhere, so it wasn't like he could have gone far. There was only one possible explanation. He'd managed to hitch a ride out of there. You think he called the paramedics himself? Well, it makes sense, right? Splatter yourself with some of the blood at a mass murder scene and the medics aren't exactly going to be picky about who they pick up. He's breathing. So you get him to the wagon ASAP. Of course, this particular victim was breathing a little too well for his or their own good. I guess they may be adding a new phrase to the ambulance protocol handbook. Never give drugs to a psychopath. <laughs>